Hello everyone, Robin Dufault here, 2020 CDAR President. This month for the Board of Director Recap, I want to introduce Andy Mallon, who sits on the board, and she's going to do the recap for the July Board of Director meeting. Thanks so much. Take it away, Andy. Hi, Robin, and thank you so much for the introduction. Yes, I am happy to go over some of the highlights from our last board meeting. First of all, let's talk about membership. CDAR membership has continued to grow, and between July 1st and July 22nd, we've had 16 new Realtor members, 20 new MLS members, and seven new offices join our association. Let's talk about policies. Your directors are continuously looking at CDAR policies and procedures to ensure that they're aligned with current business practices, and we updated a few of those in July. First one was clarification that CDAR members are charged a reduced rate for, as a member benefit for CDAR events and activities, and non-members, although invited, will be charged a higher rate. The second policy we reviewed was clarification and addressing any conflicts of interest or perceived conflicts of interest when hiring speakers for our events and education programs. The third item was regarding our virtual caravan meetings and our marketing meetings on Thursday mornings and our property pitches, it's a tongue twister, property pitches, which is a CDAR member benefit. Attendance at the virtual meetings also includes our CDAR affiliates. And then the last one, we discussed our virtual conference policies, which will prohibit driving and participating in a CDAR virtual conference. We, this is established for the safety of our participants and to adhere to distracted driver motor vehicle codes. No driving while zooming. All right, did you know that CDAR has a long range plan? We do. We have a 2020 to 2025 CDAR strategic long range plan, which was approved. This strategic plan defines where CDAR sees itself today and the vision for the future. It's a high level path that CDAR plans to take to move from where we are today to its vision. And finally, the key near term priorities to begin this journey. We announced our 2021 California State Association of Realtors directors, and they are Rich LaRue, Stephanie Taylor, Marnie Baylug, Linda Capella, Robin Dufault, Beverly Fitzgerald, Scott Newton, Susan Marshall, Heather Osier, and Stephanie Zinn. Congratulations to you all. The following association, California Association of Realtors Directors for Life, will also be funded to attend the 2021 CAR business meetings. They are Judy Ziegler, Mary Funk, and Pat Fredericks. CDAR will also fund Stefan Burchard to attend the 2021 CAR business meetings. Stefan is a 2021 Housing Affordability Fund committee member, and these committee members are appointed to a three-year term, and 2021 is Stefan's last year as an HAF member. Our next CDAR Board of Directors meeting will be held on August 19th at 2 p.m. The meeting will be held via Zoom and of course, all of our CDAR colleagues are invited to participate and attend. So thanks, Robin. Make it a great day, everyone. Thanks, Sandy. That was a great report. And I look forward to everyone coming to see us next month. Same time, same place. Bye.